You know, I appreciate hugs, but, um, this is a really weird way to hug somebody. Oh, then what are you doing? <laughs> I'll have you know, this is my hoodie. If I wanted to borrow yours, I would ask you. Well, if, if I remembered. No, this is my hoodie. Well, <laughs> I always order larger sizes. It makes me feel comfortable. Like all snuggled up in a blanket. Kind of like a blanket. Well, um, a hoodie. Blanket. <sighs> I think I just sound suspicious. Um, it's really weird that your hoodie went missing. But this one is mine. Well, I mean, <laughs> it is weird that it is the same kind, but, um, I just really think yours are so comfortable, so I, I just got the same kind. Well, of course that didn't sound believable. You're making me nervous. Accusing me of something I didn't do. It's just so, so rude, so awful, so something I would do. Well, I mean, it's not exactly bad that you're accusing me. Since, you know, I've done it so many times before. But I always returned your hoodies in good condition. Okay, that was one stain. One permanent stain. <laughs> one large permanent stain. But I, I, I offered to pay um, for another one, or to pay you back for it, and you said no. Because it would just, um, not be of any use or something. My throat is a little dry. Maybe I should go get a drink. Some water. <laughs> I don't have anything to hide. Why would I wear your hoodie in front of you and then try to deny that it's yours? It, it just, it doesn't make any sense. Okay, I've only done it twice before. Two times, out of all the other times I've borrowed your hoodies. It's, um, I, I learned from that. It's, it's not that I'm suspicious. It's just, um, you're making me nervous. I just love you so much, and... You being this close to me without hugging me, it's just a little, a little weird. Okay, I don't know how to prove to you that this isn't yours. Hmm. Unless I find yours. Don't be like a great detective. Solving the case. Proving you wrong. <laughs> I mean, it wouldn't be the goal to prove you wrong. It's just... Well, you always prove that I'm wrong. 
I, I just, I want it to be my turn. <laughs> No, you see, this isn't going to be a trick. I'm not just going to take off this hoodie and say I found yours. I'm not going to do that again. I'm going to... I'm going to find your hoodie. Where did you last have it? Well, I guess it makes sense you wouldn't remember. Or else you'd be able to find it. Unless he couldn't because it was moved by the raccoons. Yes, yes. The raccoons are making a comeback, you see. They went on vacation, and now they're back. And the first thing they want is your hoodie. Now, where would they hide it? Now, this is no joking matter. I'm being completely serious. With a hint of being silly, but that's not the- that's- that's not important. <laughs> <sighs> Let's see. If I were you, where would I wear the hoodie? Everywhere. That means the hoodie could be anywhere. Just great, okay. Come on, I'm trying to make this fun. <sighs> Let's see. Let's say you were sitting on the couch with your hoodie on, just relaxing, watching some TV. You get tired, you fall asleep, you know, and then you take a cute little nap. And you do that thing where you kind of snore and turn over because you're just so cute. Mm. Sorry. So um, you take a nap, and while you sleep, the raccoons come in. They, they they're sneaky, but precise. They take your hoodie and just run off into the night. Uh, or you fell asleep and were uncomfortable in your hoodie. You took it off and it fell under one of the couch cushions or the little decorative pillow. Well, I'm just suggesting the couch because I can see it right there. Yeah, do you see the arm of your hoodie? It's kind of popping out right there under that pillow. Well, that wasn't really much of a case. Or maybe I'm just a really good detective. Solving mysteries and... Making the love of my life happy. Hmm? <laughs> I told you I was telling the truth. I really did get this hoodie. Well, well I just know that that one is your favorite and well, I didn't want to take it and just somehow ruin it like I am. Um, did the other one. Ruin, stain, I mean, are they so similar? Mm, right. <laughs> so I, I got this one. Now, you don't have to apologize to me. Especially since I always borrow your hoodies. But if you want to... Show me your appreciation from solving the case. How about... Mm. I was going to say cuddles on the couch. 
But if you want to get me ice cream, then... Then... Then yeah, let's do that. Or we can do both. No, no, there's no going back. You already said it. I'll get the keys, and we'll go get some ice cream. It'll be a job well done. <laughs> I love you.